Uh, okay. Time for day three of Valkyrie Profile. Which I have to say, I have enjoyed immensely so far. So now that we have uh, gotten Lorenta and whatnot, it is time for us to start. And so, yeah. To go places we're not supposed to go. So first we're gonna go over here, I think, to Garabellum. <coughs> Thank you, Sornus Bear, for the follow. These losers are even worth the trouble. Forget this. I'm going home. Is that... Hmm. Hey, what was she like? Was she beautiful? What a fool. She was barely 14. I guess she was kind of cute, but she... She would have been beautiful. Oh god. This game really doesn't go two fucking seconds without just slugging you in the feels. She wasn't all that special looking, but... But what? It was just... Her hair was silver, and when the light struck it, it shimmered like a sapphire. It was so beautiful. Hmm... You guys give me one you second. Still love her oh, after all perfect. These years. Silver hair? That's a totally different person. As a side note, that was our twentieth Twitch follower, which is fucking awesome. The only thing that's the same is the color of her hair. I mean, the girl he was talking about, she's dead. Mm-mm. Ouch! What am I doing? I'm not gonna get all jealous over some total stranger. That's just pathetic. <laughs> she said while getting jealous over some total stranger, pathetically. <laughs> Thank the gods. You're going to be okay. Please forgive her. She's just a child. She? <clears throat> the girl who threw the rock at you was my daughter. Although we're not related by blood. Why are you talking like that? Auntie Dorsey! How are you today, Madam Dorsey? Who brought today's earnings? Oh, is that you, Lucian? Thank you for your generosity. I'm sorry, I forgot my stupid old person accent halfway through that line. Oh yes, this young lady is Meryl. Earlier today, Claire hit her with a rock. Claire? Claire did that? That isn't like her. What a fucking bitch. Holy shit. Wow, what the fuck would somebody do that? Holy shit. Whoa. What's wrong? She... I... I'm sorry. She's just... I'm... She's so hot. It is good to meet you, Lucian, was it? Uh, yeah, wow, you're really hot. A withered old woman like me can't make it living alone, but I'm able to live like this because Lucian brings me money each and every day. But lately I've been hearing upsetting rumors. It makes me wonder if my foster children are doing something improper to get the money. What do you care why I did it? Fine. Did it because I was jealous. Did it because she was beautiful. I did it because of her silver hair. 
Claire. And that was your name, right? You don't you don't know how it makes me feel. Hello. Hello. Having to share you with her ghost. Oh jeez. Whoa. Dude, this game is so fucking That's dark. A really rough you missed line. yesterday when uh, some dude was creating soulless clones of the Valkyrie. With nice. the intention of like baiting her and trapping her. Wow, that's uh. Pretty yeah, how about it, huh? Seal value is down to 66, guys. So now we need to go to the Weeping Lily Meadow. By the way, we made some alterations to the configuration that should prevent the uh, weird glitchiness from happening. Oh no. They're specters. Your kind should not be here. The fuck out of here. Why would specters gather around the stone? Is this a grave marker? Who would put a grave in a place like this? Yeah! Oh, no, I have control. Yeah! Okay. Is that it? I guess I just leave now? Well, that should reduce our seal value by quite a lot. Yep. Alright, and now we go to Brahms Castle, which will be an actual dungeon. And we get to go all the way through, which is why we waited to go, so that we could just do it in one go. <clears throat> we are going to try to fight him, just to see if we can do it. Even though it's extremely unlikely. Oh shit, there's a time on it. Uh, in that case, I'm gonna do my prep before I go in there. So we should have gotten an item that we can transmute into. That's pretty cool. Um. Transmute into something really cool. Let's see if we actually got it. It looks like we may not have. I may have goofed. Looks like I might have goofed, guys. Hmm. Yeah, it's looking like I might have goofed. Damn. Wait, maybe not then. Oh, did I put Oh, I totally didn't goof. Okay, cool. Awesome, I didn't goof, guys. Cool, so now we have this uh, creation gem here, and we can make some super badass off armors and stuff. Now we're gonna transmute the manual of resurrection <laughs> into an Ori Halcom. And we take the Ori Halcom. Or Orialcon and turn into a creation jewel. Now we equip the creation jewel. Do I have to unequip the creation gem? Mason 
Ooh, replace creation gem. Let's find out. Alright, well, let's replace the coin of fortune with the creation jewel. And now we should be able to make some crazy shit. Yes. Like, turn that into a fucking badass icicle sword. Also technical terms. Of course. It says so right there on the screen. Mm -hmm. the yeah. That's a little known uh, translation error. Now, I wish we hadn't transmuted all those broken things, so apparently turn they turn into really cool items. Oh, wait, never mind. We still have two of these. Very cool. This can turn into Scarlet Edge. This can turn into Last Trial. Uh huh. And I'm just doing the good ones. Okay, so now we can go learn these new skills we just got, which is Scarlet Edge, Last Trial, Charge, and Resist Damage. And let's see, we got something else too. Alright, we got the two uh, new, new guard items. So we'll take this off and put on Glare Guard, which is a counterattack. Which is really good. Flare Guard. Go back to Mirage Road for her. Let's see what this new skill is. Scarlet Edge. Adds down effect to normal attack. Okay. Charge. Fires a blast which causes 1.5 times attack power damage. Man, all these things just use their fucking HP up though, which I don't like. Oh, more, uh, more damage reduction. Yes, please. What? Oh, um, I'm watching a, a you know, how, uh, Failure has just got a good start. Uh-huh. He's sent me a video, uh, that, and simply comments that I made a mistake. It's a video of Max, and it's the biggest forest fire I've ever seen. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. I've done it too. Well, I think everybody who's played that game has, has started a couple forest fires. Right, we're gonna crank this sh fucking resist damage up on everybody who can get it because it's, you know, pretty good, man. Uh, last trial. Oh, cool, it's a death curse. That's pretty sweet. Alright. Now we're gonna save and we are gonna fucking blaze through Brahms Castle, guys. Here we go. Four minute time limit, so we gotta get fucking serious. Go, 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 go! In fact, I think we're gonna put on the dimension slip. Just so we can get the treasure and not worry about the bad guys in the time limit. Brahms is such a troll, he's got all his fucking treasure chests facing the wrong way. What a dick! Holy shit! This guy's a complete bastard. I mean, he is the king of the undead, so... I guess I shouldn't be too terribly surprised about it. It's a nice-ass house! Am I stuck in like an infinite hallway or something? Okay. Okay. There's a save point. Okay. This whole house is kinda yeah, yeah, of course. This whole house is kinda slanty. So I don't know if it's racist for me to say that, but 